hello everyone in this video i am going to show you how to make contemporary stew this stew is delicious but it's so so healthy and good for you guys if you're new to my channel welcome my name is jasmine i recently moved to ghana and i'm sharing all my experiences along the way in the hopes to inspire you and teach you a thing or two so yeah go ahead and subscribe by clicking that red button give this video a thumbs up turn on your notification bell so you don't miss another upload from me and yeah let's get right into it so the star of this dish is contumery which is like spinach leaves uh they make they you get them from coco coco yam leaves so um i don't know if you guys know what coco yam is i don't know if there's another name for it but it's like a root um vegetable that is it's like a starchy vegetable that is is uh that grows underneath the ground but anyway the leaves are very very good for you um they really help with like anemia and stuff like that it's rich in calcium it's so so good for you it really helps with digestion if you really want to lose weight and stuff like that there's healthy ways of using this healthier ways of using this in your recipes Anyways, those seeds I was just washing is um, pumpkin seeds. We call them agushi. Um, I've just washed it and removed all the um, dead ones out there. So I'm just gonna go ahead and chop my contumery. Aisha was helping me out with this dish because I was cooking at my grandma's place. So for my pumpkin seeds, I'm just gonna pop it in the blender, add a little bit of water, and then blend it into a creamy consistency. For my contemporary, I'm going to put it into a bowl, cover it in water, and then I'm going to cook it completely. It took me about 20 minutes or so to cook it completely, um, and yeah. Have you guys had this dish before? If you ha if you have, do let me know in the comment section below. Is there a different way that you guys make it as well? So that is my pumpkin seeds grounded. That's the consistency I got. Here is the rest of the ingredients. I've got some smoked salmon, uh, one large onion, four small tomatoes, and this is my blended ginger, garlic, and pepper. And I've got some dried shrimps here. These shrimps add so, so much flavor to the sauce, guys. You guys cannot eliminate it. You need to add it to the dish, okay? Unless, of course, you're vegan. So usually I put them in whole, but my family friend, Mercy, was at the house today and she was showing me that if you take off the legs uh, of the um, prawns, it helps because then you're likely to not get any dirt in your food i usually put them in whole and i guess i eat the dirt and taste fine but this time we got rid of the legs thanks to mercy okay so this is what it's looking like it looks a lot cleaner for sure um it still tastes the same it didn't really take away from the flavor getting rid of the legs so i guess we're going to continue doing that and next time we're going to do it like that again so now we're gonna go ahead and get started with our stew. I'm just gonna add some palm oil to the pot and then I'm going to add some fermented salted fish to the pot as well. Allow it to cook till it's completely dissolved and then I'm going to add in my onions. How are you guys doing? Are you guys still in lockdown? Has the lockdown been lifted? Here in Ghana, it's partially lifted. Only social gatherings and like recreational stuff are still closed, but business is as usual. So everything seems like it's gone back to normal, basically. Um, I'm not sure what it's like in other countries. I'd love to know. So I cooked the onions until it was a little bit soft, and then I'm going to add my um tomatoes in there the tomatoes you can of course blend it you don't have to chop it like i have but it's just easier to do it that way for me so that's exactly what i did i'm just checking in on my spinach it's pretty much nearly done i think i left it on for another five minutes or so before i turned it off um i didn't use the water from the spinach but you can if you want to this is um, cow skin called wele in Ghana. 
to add it that as well that's completely optional you don't have to add it to this recipe so i've just gone ahead now that my tomatoes it has softened i've gone ahead and added my dried shrimps and my willy to the sauce and i'm just going to stir it in it's coming together beautifully guys what do you think All right, so I'm gonna let that cook for about five minutes or so, and then I'm going to go ahead and add in my cooked spinach, and then give that a good stir. Because the contemporary is already cooked, I didn't have to leave it on for too long, and then I added my blended pumpkin seeds, and then I covered it, and then I let it cook for another five or 10 minutes till you get this like, egg-like consistency and then you can stir it i had this with yam so aisha helped me prep that and put that on fire and get that going so once that was done the um contumer is basically done this is what it looks like once it's ready it's very very delicious like if you guys want to make it healthier you can eliminate like the cow skin reduce the amount of oil you use or use a better alternative to palm oil as well coconut oil is great you can use that um, but yeah that is pretty much it guys this turned out so so good it was delicious it didn't really last very long i made it in my grandma's house so there's tons of people to eat the food all the time so yeah guys thank you so so much for watching i appreciate the love and the support don't forget to follow your bliss now life is short follow your bliss now nipa ye ding follow your bliss now die besi bia ye and follow your bliss now den ne mada take care guys i will see you in my next one bye You still have to take more, and you are eating more. Asha <laughs> <laughs> is enjoying her food. Do you want to be nice? Hey guys, my food is ready. We are about to dig in. Just taking a bit of the avocado. I don't know if you can see. A little bit of sauce. A little bit of my yam. Hmm. Guys, contour for your pate be okay. Mm. This is good. There's so much flavor from those prawns. You guys need to make sure you try it with the prawns, okay? There's a million people in my house today, so it's very loud. Mm. Delicious.